We'll go over the following configuration tasks required to integrate Oracle ERP Cloud Budgetary Control with Oracle EPM Planning Financials Budget Revision. Enable budgetary control for a ledger or project. Manage control budgets for EPM Planning Financials integration. Related videos and tutorials are listed in the description. Before starting the setup process, Make sure to review the configuration and integration considerations listed in the hands-on tutorial. The What Do You Need section also lists the minimum requirements for the setup. In Oracle ERP Cloud, enable budgetary control for a ledger or project. Edit your ledger and select Enable Budgetary Control for the ledger and all journal sources and categories. See the Enabling Budgetary Control and Encumbrance Accounting section in the Using Financials for the Public Sector documentation. When you enable budgetary control, consider these options. Control Budget Filter Fail budgetary control for budget dates not in valid budget date range Default Date Rule Save your changes. Next, create a control budget. You use control budgets to check the spending against a ledger, project, or both and apply validations during budgetary control. Note down the names of the control budgets you plan to use in the integration. You'll be adding these as EPM Planning Financial Smart List entries. Select a budget calendar and period range. For source budget type, make sure to select EPM Financials Module. Accept or rename the source budget name. The source budget name defaults to the control budget name. Select the currency and rate type. Select the ledger you enabled for budgetary control. Assign a budget manager. Select Chart of Account Segments for the control budget structure. Then, save your control budget and prepare it for use. Related videos and tutorials are listed in the description. To learn more, visit docs.oracle.com.